Well, hello everyone, it's me, Daniel, with Website Candy, and I want to show you guys a really neat design that's really winning on Instagram, okay? Now, I am on the Tampa Bay Buccaneers Instagram page here, and as you can see right over in here, that we have an effect that's very easy to pull off. And I'm not going to take you all the way to the end of it. I'm just going to just show you how this guy's pronounced and this guy's kind of back here in the shadows. Very simple, very easy. Now, what I did was I just came over here to Google and typed in Tampa Bay Buccaneers. And as you can see here, we have all kind of different images of Doug Martin, one of him standing, one of him running the ball right here. And they look pretty good. As I look at the size dimension, 600 by 532, it's pretty worthy for Photoshop. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just take this, drag it off, and drop it right here in Photoshop. So I have this image right here in Photoshop. I already have this one in Photoshop with the Doug Martin standing. And here's my canvas I want to work with right here, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take Doug Martin, I'm just going to take this layer, and I'm going to drag it to this right here, and I'm going to hold Shift, and I'm just going to move it over to the right of where I'm actually working, okay? So the Doug Martin standing here giving you the death stare, I'm going to do the exact same thing. I'm going to drop it back here and just hold Shift and let go. Now this Doug Martin, actually both of them I'm going to free transform really quickly. hate to bore you, but it has to be done. And make sure that you free transform within a smart object for the simple fact that you don't want to uh, be, you want to be non-destructive. You don't want to get to the point to where you can't go back because if you resize this in a format to where it's not a smart object and you go to try to resize it again it will pixelate but sometimes that's a cool effect so right here what I want to do is I want to just kind of position it the way I want it I'm just going to get this Doug Martin right here and I'm going to put him over here and it's very simple very easy now this one right here to create that effect we want to kind of uh, desaturate him so I'm going to just right click I'm going to rasterize the layer and I'm just going to hit command shift and U, and you can see right here he's black and white I'm just gonna bring the opacity down just a little bit to kind of pit him in the shadows like you've seen there on Instagram and boom you got a really awesome design already going for you here okay so it's really simple really easy it doesn't matter if you're a football player basketball player motivational coach or you just want some cool images on Instagram now I've already went on ahead and I've created some of the different little layers that we can create in regards to you know I just added a filter so here's a filter right here and I've also added a little bit of a a tire mark right there and I have his name in Tampa Bay Buccaneers that I've already created there but as you can see how this effect right here will do really 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 well in regards to Instagram so this layer right here once again I can kind of bring the opacity down just a little bit more to kind of put him in the back shadows very simple very easy as you can see right here on Instagram you can do whatever it is you want to do and it gets very very engaging 5,000 hits on this post right here and it's a matter of kind of showing different angles of what you're trying to really present there to create a really really awesome design go ahead and give it a try and let me know how you did all right talk to you guys later goodbye now